and um, welcome to the community gardens. I wanted to show you a really simple way of making some bird feeders. It's one of the things we often um, have running as a drop-in activity when we can be having our events. So I wanted to show you that. Um, it's really easy and the birds will really like to eat these. What you need is some apples and some seeds. Um, generally I use uh, sunflower seeds because um, they're quite a nice size to push in um, but any bird seed um, that you can get hold of will work and um, a few little twigs and that's kind of all you need and you basically you can use the apples whole or you can cut them um, in half or in other sections if you want to um, and you just simply push the uh, sunflower seeds into the apple don't push them the whole way in push them so that a little bit is sticking out and the birds will really like eating the seeds and the apple and then you can find different ways to hang them up and you can use the sticks they can poke in and they become like little perches and you can really be inventive with these so you can just push lots of seeds into the apple but you could make a pattern you might want to turn them into little creatures um, you don't need to have more than a couple of sticks as perches but you might want to add lots and make it be all sorts of interesting um, hair for a creature perhaps hedgehogs you can be really really inventive with this um, and it works well for um, any age, um, children, adults, it's really good fun. Um, and then you can hang them up and see how many birds come and eat the seeds. We've got so many birds that use the hedgerows here. Um, and the kind of birds you might find really enjoying eating from these will be things like uh, chaffinches, um, blue tits, great tits, um, lots of birds that eat seeds and it's quite relaxing sitting outside pushing seeds into an apple. <laughs> um, you can hear lots of birds chattering in the hedgerows, hopefully you can hear it on the camera here but there's loads around us at the moment. Um, there's lots of starlings in uh, the hedgerows here, robins, blackbirds singing away. At this time of year, um, and this is kind of late February, um, they're really beginning to mark out their territory and sing to begin to find a mate. So you really start to notice the birds um, picking up their activity, singing more, um, be more vocal, defending their territories. <laughs> You'll not be able to see but there's a huge flock of starlings just to one side of me, chattering away. So as you do this, um, you can use your imagination with the patterns that you make on the apple. You can really um, be inventive, you can make all sorts of patterns, you might want to make a smiley face Put them round in lines or stripes or swirls or just push them in randomly anything will work the birds don't mind they just want to be able to take the seed out so if i bring it a little bit closer you can see and i'll work my way around and do the whole apple Some birds might land and then rather than eat a seed from here they will take it out and then they'll go and land in um, a hedge somewhere where they feel a little bit safe and they'll sit and eat the seed separately. So it's quite interesting watching how different birds um, behave a little bit differently on feeders. So um, you can hang them up with a little bit of string as well. I'll bring this a bit closer so you can see. So I have just made a hole very carefully through the apple um, 
and that one has got um, a piece of string attached to a stick and that just keeps the string in place um, with a very simple little knot and then um, I'll make a little loop in the top so I can hang them up. Obviously there's no seeds in this one yet um, but uh, yes you want to find different ways to hang them up. You can place them just on a bird feeder as well um, and you'll find the kind of birds that really like the apples um, might be slightly different to the birds that will come and eat the seeds. Blackbirds particularly like apples, they're really good. These actually are some of our cooking apples um, from the apple tree here at the community gardens, um, which we keep some of them um, very carefully, but the windfall apples that are left on the floor, the birds really, really like those. 